वेलकम व्यूवर्स टू सॉफ्ट अकेडमी अ प्रोजेक्ट कंट्रोल एंड इंजीनियरिंग सॉफ्टवेयर अकेडमी टूडेज टॉपिक इज वेरी इजी एंड वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू अबाउट यू क्रिएट योर प्राइमावेर पी सिक्स कैजुअल एंड सम पीपल डो नॉट हैव एसेस टू एक्जी आर रीडर आर दे डोंट हैव एनी प्राइमावेर पी सिक्स एक्जी आर फाइल आर दे कैन नॉट एसेस डेट वन सो मोस्टली पीपल यूज एक्जिल स्टिल नाव and microsoft project most people do not use right now so most of our clients and our contractor and our monitoring team at the site work with excel they know the excel scheduling and they want to do that one so how can you do that one with your a non technical or non uh, person which uh, do not know about the planning so here we go our video is based on how can you create your gantt chart in excel as you have an xr file a primavera p6 so here is the schedule which i have created and i want to give that schedule to my monitoring team and they don't know about the primavera p6 even they don't have installed any stand alone or any cloud version in their setup so this is the schedule of 2022 so i have to deliver that one to into excel because i need some monitoring dates and also i want to tell them that what is its actual actual plan and what is its finish and also i want to get the backup data from them what is activity percent complete and also i want to put my duration percent complete in it also uh, i want to uh, tell them uh, what is the budgeted hours for that activity so how can we create that one we can just copy this one and export and but we cannot create the gantt chart easily so here i have a tool which is called schedule analyzer so i will open that schedule analyzer and you can see that schedule analyzer schedule analyzer in www.softwaredemy.com from shop you can get that one and also the link of that scheduler has been Uh, given in the description of video that schedule analyzer you can access from the link also you can visit that www.softydemy.com and from shop slash shop so from here we will load xr file when we click on load and we will select the xr file and press okay when we press okay the file will be loaded it will take some seconds and you will see the file is available here when we click the file all the data at the dashboard will be appeared so dashboard always appear how many activities are there what is the float what are the labor hours what are the non labor hours what are, what is the total cost also how many activities have been completed how many activities are ongoing so it's 1607 activities are there in the schedule i want to create that one a gantt chart so that gantt chart is our schedule so if you want to just open your only activities you don't want to create a gantt chart so you will select this one if you don't want to share or you don't want to show only activities so you uncheck this one also the select column option you can see that one you can show your start finish and also your actual start and actual finish also activity id you can show levels float percent duration percent and performance percent you can also share that performance percent is basically activity percent labor if you want to show the budgeted labor and actual labor column also you can show non labor budgeted actual i show you you can show and also you can show budgeted and actual also i will press okay and i will view and i will view the file will be created also with that excel file it will be created a separate file also it will take some second some time 100% done it have taken 12.07 second now the file have been created you can see there is the file in that one the file all the levels have been created you can see here there are nine levels created here also all the table which i have displayed their actual non labor every column which and by chart non labor every column which i have instructed actual cost budget cost and also 
uh, activity percent complete that was given as a performance percent you can write and update here activity percent and also duration percent is there also budgeted labor and actual also appear here and duration i have already told you and that is budgeted labor hours also the float have been given start and finish you can add here an additional column so you cannot import back from this one you cannot import back or you cannot save here any file so this is just generating so we we can just uh, use traditional method to just copy the data from here we look up and we can get our activity percent from here and we can get and import back into primavera p6 that easy method i will tell you in another video now i want to show you the gantt chart here that the gantt chart has been uh, displayed here 2022 all that the gantt chart activities you can see here already they are linked with it you can see here so if you want to show that gantt chart throughout the project here the timeline i will just go here and press this one and i will go here view and i will go here and freeze the pans i will freeze the pans here and when i freeze the pan here and you can see here when you go down and any activity or any cell when you click this one for example you want to know this one and that is 30 of may 2022 so easily your all your whole team also that is printable you can print that one in a bigger chart also you can use at that one at the side also you can just uh, click all this one up to last of this one and also you can increase the size of this one so the gantt chart will be more expanded so it will not take more time so your site team also maybe some clients the need of their uh, schedule on excel will be completed from here also you can get your all the updates from here also if you need to change the color of your wbs that's very easy and very easy step we will just select every row for here if i want to change the color of uh, level one level one color if i need to change that one into uh, any color like uh, if i change that one to dark this one and now i will go here level two when i will select level two i will uncheck this one at level two you can change all the colors from here at level two you can see here this one level three from here select this level three and now at the level three you can change all these colors all the level colors from here you can change from here and now when i just select all and show you can see the changes here in the coloring of your gantt chart also you can add here you can add here in additionally this file have been additionally created when you just uh, view the file the file have been additionally created here and you can also just uh, write here and merge that one and write the title of the project here like this one the title of the project you can copy this one you can write here programmer works what the formatting you want to do you can do here and you can give that file to your all the monitoring team which we monitor your project so this is my uh, today's content about how can you create your uh, schedule in primavera from primavera p6 to excel how can you convert your primavera p6 schedule into excel so p6 conversion to excel easily without wasting your time and you can give that one to your team so this is our today's content if you have any question if you want to get this uh, schedule analyzer the link have been given below in the description of video contact with us on whatsapp number that have given at the end of this video also you can visit our site www.softedemy.com